Britain's longest-serving spy of the Second World War wasn't a man. Christine Granville wasn't British either. Born Christina Skarbek in Poland, she was determined to play her part in Hitler's downfall. She worked behind enemy lines and saved many lives. She also smuggled film showing where the German tanks were really heading. This shows the significance of the information that Christine was uh, involved in smuggling to the British. And uh, for that work, Churchill told his daughter, Sarah Oliver, that Christine was his favourite spy. 75 years on, Christine is finally being recognised with her own blue plaque. Her biographer told me it is high time. A lot of the women's stories have fallen through the gaps um, and I think there is this rich seam of untold women's history. And it, I hesitate to call it women's history, it's history in which women are the most active agents. And Christina Scarbeck was a special agent. If you take her agency away, she is nothing. And we need to remember that there are many, many other women like her. The unveiling was meant to be a big do, but has been cancelled because of Covid. The plaque is part of a determined push. There's a lot more to do to, um, to recognise the contribution of women, yes, and certainly with the London Blue Plaque Scheme, we're painfully aware of that. It's still, you know, we have, there are 950 plaques and only around 14% of those are to women. Christine Glanville did become a British citizen, receiving the George Medal and OBE and now her very own plaque. I'm absolutely inspired by her. She's a complete hero, um, incredibly brave, but incredibly effective in what she set out to achieve as well. And that, for me, is a wonderful story we should all be talking about. Well, we are now. After far too much time in the shadows, Christina Scarbeck is finally getting the recognition she deserves. Simon Viger, Five News.